Hi guys, my name is Ashley. I'm 25 years of age. I'm now working at Guango Heritage uh, Resort. So I studied Lena Professional Guide, which is uh, some call it uh, guiding, like tour guiding in short. So basically we're dealing with uh, animals and having tourists around. So I chose uh, guiding because I find that it, it's um, versatile. Like sometimes you, you, you wake up and you just don't feel like yourself. But then when you're told that you have a drive and you're about to go inside the park and show other people around, it's actually nice. You definitely like it automatically deletes whatever was happening with you, whatever was melting you down. You totally forget about it. And then you start focusing on making those other guys enjoy the drive because um, with tourists, they would have saved more, more like uh, maybe two to three years saving to come and see the beauty of your country, to see the beauty of Zimbabwe, the beauty of Wanga National Park. So now I'm supposed to make their visits memorable, make their visit, visits more enjoyable and everything. So I won't show them that, well, I woke up with a meltdown in the morning. I just have to make them enjoy. So that's why I really like, I just felt like, no, you know what? This is my fault. I'm fine. I'm happy with this. Like if I'm to sit in the office the whole day, it's just so boring and it's so stressful and draining. About my industry, well, at first, um, for me, it was scary. At first, it was scary, but then with time, I got used. And as you continue going into the park and coming back alive and interacting with those animals, I ended up getting uh, used, and that fear is totally gone. But now the challenges that are there, um, it wasn't a, a normal thing to have females being in the field guiding right but now companies are trying by all means to to have females within the industry although it's still a bit difficult for other males you know them they just males are always feel threatened and challenged whenever they see uh, a female standing up for themselves and doing the same thing that they do and challenging them here and there it's still a bit of a challenge to, to some other but yet to others they are now used to it and will be fine <laughs> Well, International Women's Day to me, it means us as uh, ladies, as women, as the time whereby we get appreciated and we also appreciate each other and be appreciated by the society of the works that we have done or of the works that we are doing. So it doesn't necessarily mean we can just celebrate on that particular day and just celebrate the little achievements that happened. But you might have uh, achieved something last year, be it or small or big, but it was an achievement and done by a woman. Something which wasn't done long back then. We were never um, put at, like in the spotlight, but now we are trying to upgrade ourselves. So I think uh, it's um, very much important to take note of that day and really uh, appreciate women regardless of their positions or their posts and everything. Once we continue appreciating each other and all, it gives other young women as well uh, the confidence to stand up for themselves in the society that still, uh, some societies that still believe that a girl child cannot do A, B, C, D. But once we continue appreciating each other, then they get that confidence that, no, I can also do this and I can also, like, drive a teeper or I can also be, you know, the president and stuff, yeah. To all the young women out there, please uh, just come and join me in the tourism industry. Come and join me doing guiding. It's fun. Uh, it's never too late. You come, you do your lessons there, the learner professional guide, and then you come and join and you interact with tourists. You interact with people from different countries, different continents. It's actually great and fun. You get to learn uh, a lot of things from those guys, how they live that side. And also they will be learning from you. But at the end of the day, you make new friends. And those who want to get married, you might even meet your soulmates along the way. <laughs>